Most Apple products come standard with built-in wireless capability, which on a Mac is called Airport. So you can do everything from getting on the internet, to downloading content from iTunes, to printing, all without the need to plug wires or cables directly to your Mac. To see how you can take advantage of your Mac's wireless capabilities, it helps to have a basic understanding of the types of wireless technologies there are and how they work. The first and most prevalent type of wireless networking technology is Wi-Fi. It uses radio waves to transmit and receive information and is primarily used for accessing the internet and transferring data between devices without wires. Wi-Fi transmits large amounts of data over long ranges, so you can use it to check email, surf the web, download movies and music, and share large files with other computers. For a Wi-Fi network in your home, you need an Apple Airport base station that's connected to the internet through a DSL or cable modem. Another form of wireless technology is Bluetooth. It transmits data at shorter distances between two devices, and you've probably noticed it as a common feature in cell phones. It's what allows you to use wireless headsets. But you can also find Bluetooth in devices like keyboards and mice, which make for a clean, cable-free workspace. Let's take a look at how Wi-Fi works in a home. Here we have a base station connected to a DSL modem. The base station has been configured and given a name. Now, any computers or devices that are enabled for Wi-Fi can join the wireless network and use the internet connection. A printer is also connected to the base station. That means anyone connected to the wireless network can print without plugging directly into the printer. You can connect to wireless networks at cafes, airports, or other public places to do things like surf the web, get email, and video chat. Some networks require a password to join. Others are free and open to the public. If you happen to be somewhere with an existing wireless network, like at a cafe or a friend's house, joining the network with your Mac is easy. Just click the airport symbol in the menu bar. Here, you'll see a list of wireless networks within range. Select the network you wish to join, enter the password, if you're prompted for one, and click OK. Now, you can browse the web with Safari, video conference with iChat, send emails with mail, and more. To find out which airport product is best for you, visit apple.com slash wifi.